Look at this background. I like it. It's a perfect background. It's gentry. To the bank of all size. It's an OG. Outro vlogging you. It's just vlogging you crazy at the moment. It's day two in Rio. Just woke up. I did just wake up. <laughs> wake up like this. Um, have a shower. We are uh, just having just having my cafezinho. I love this. Beautiful. After my cafezinho, I need to go shop. Padaria. To get some pão de queijo. Pão francês is what I want today. And then, after that, laptop update. So, I just checked and the laptop has arrived in Rio de Janeiro in the DHL sorting office. I personally would like to drive over there and just pick it up myself. I'll sort it out for them, I'll do the job, but I gotta wait for it to be delivered to the address. Um, and then hopefully go and collect it, maybe today. Depends when it arrives. Um, but yeah, I also have to go over to the Apple store. Where's the Apple store? Bajo de Tajuca. Bajo de Tajuca is where the Apple store is. Bajo de Tajuca. So go over there and hopefully and take my laptop in for a opinion from the Apple professionals so they can tell me if it's worth fixing or not or if it's dead. Um, and then I don't know what we're going to do after. Probably go out somewhere. Uh, the weather's alright so I'm hoping that it'll be a nice sunset tonight. It'd be good if we can get a nice sunset. Who knows what these adventures are going to have in store for us today in Rio de Janeiro. Look at this guys. More Christmas stuff. 5th of November. Do you think it's too early for that? I don't know. But all I know is when I step outside and it's 25 Celsius. <laughs> seeing this kind of stuff really confuses my brain. I don't feel like it's November. It really confuses me as someone from the Northern Hemisphere. Confused. space in the kitchen so this is what I've got what we have all kind of things love it fresh fresh as can be beautiful and I have some queijo and some Presunto. I'm gonna put it right inside of there. Misto. Prepared. We didn't really have a um, the, the proper thing you need for to make misto, so we kind of had to do it in the toaster. It's not ideal, but it kind of worked. Mm. Love misto. So, me personally, I love pimento, and I think it goes really well with my mishto. Just a little bit, no? It's quite a lot, actually. But uh, Tommy seems to think it's weird. I like it. Post in the comments, team pimento, or not team pimento. I mean, I like pimento with everything, but pimento's fine with like, I mean, you have it with pastel, don't you? You can have it in the toast and the breakfast. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> Just fancied a bit of pimento today. What are we doing now? 
Eu vou ir na praia agora. And we're gonna get some gourmet coconut water because we're in the blom. So the coconut water has to be gourmet here, doesn't it? Um, yeah, that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go down to the beach. I've never been to the beach in Le Blanc. I've been to the beach in Copacabana. I've been to the beach in Ipanema, but not around Le Blanc. So we'll see what's see what it's like down there. Let's get some gourmet coconut water. <laughs> I am on the beach, coconut water. So, yes, in the Blom Beach. So, I don't know if you guys know, this is my, it's kind of like my third time in Rio. Uh, the first time I came was in February 2020 last year, just before the pandemic started, before we even imagined that lockdown would happen. And I came for the carnival, and obviously it came to Rio when it was like, you know, everyone was here partying. And after that, I stayed for two weeks and then I left and went to Brasilia. And during that time, we ended up going into lockdown. And I stayed in Brazil the first time for four, like four and a half months. And most of it was in lockdown. And on the way back to London, we had to stop in Rio. It was June, right in the middle of the pandemic. And when we arrived in, in Rio, it was so quiet, so like, such like a kind of sad atmosphere. Um, so it feels good to be back here with, with the atmosphere almost almost back to normal. It's not as busy as it was in February. I don't know if that's just because it's not a carnival season or yeah, maybe there's just not many tourists here. And I guess people are working right now as well. It's a Wednesday, so I don't know. Maybe Copacabana Beach is a little bit more busy. But yeah, all in all, it's just good to be back. And it feels nice to be back in Rio. It's, a, it's, it's just one of them places, you know? It's, I know it's very like, common place to go, you just can't deny it. You enjoy it, I always enjoy it. Misbehaving, it's treating, it's not treating me the same way I treat it, it's not treating me well. I treat it very well. Right, it's abusing me. So yeah, we're gonna wait and see what they say. See what they see what they tell me. Hopefully it's um I don't even know. I expect the worst. So this is the shopping mall we came for the Apple store, a village mall in Tijuca. It's the poshest shopping mall I've ever been in my life. Uh, I've never seen Something so beautiful and posh, and all in other hands feel completely out of place. Uh, I feel like the security guard looked at my other hands and judged me for coming here. I feel unwanted. So, the Apple store will not be able to diagnose my laptop for 12 days, no? 12 days I won't be able to diagnose my Apple, Apple my laptop. So I have to wait 12 days for to get an official diagnosis from Apple. But it's probably gonna be the most expensive repair. So let's just hope that I have a laptop. I 
arriving in this package, long awaited package tomorrow. We will find out because the package has now arrived in Rio. And I'm gonna go see the package tomorrow and hopefully there's a laptop inside, which will be useful for now. But anyway, look at that time, it's a Christmas tree. Christmas tree. It's so confusing in this weather to see a Christmas tree. I know it's November, but I'm so used to seeing Christmas trees in the winter, so confusing for me. Anyway, next destination, we're gonna find a bar to go to. Oh, they these carts. These things are worth so much money. It costs a fortune to buy these things. This shopping mall has a pond in the middle of it with expensive fish, very expensive fish. Crazy. So, we're at the Tijuca by the Tijuca and we came for the sunset. But the sun went missing. <laughs> So there is no sunset. So we're just gonna stay here, watch football, and have something to drink. And probably some comida of some kind.